What's up, everybody? It's Cashflow Nexus, the channel of Faith, Trading, and Wealth. And today we are going to be doing some Ripple XRP Ichimoku analysis. So, you guys, I, I hope you guys are having a blessed day. Uh, looking at XRP and what it did last time, it, it did exactly what I said it would, following from the last video I put out. Uh, so, you could go ahead and watch that. Uh, I have another video for you guys. I'm going to leave. Go, you know, if you haven't checked out the last video, I'm gonna link it in the comment section, and I'm also going to link my uh, other video in the comment section. Uh, the video that I just got done recording, it is about uh, people that have sexual urges, and you know, overcoming those sexual urges. So definitely watch that video. Uh, before we get started, I always want to give a scripture out to you guys. I always want to give God glory on this channel. So I'm going to be coming out of Galatians 22, 5 and 22 through 23. And I'm going to read it to you guys now. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance. Against such there is no law. So the, the two that I believe that in this season that people need to have we people need to have temperance and uh definitely have temperance temperance means restraint uh and also long suffering and if you aren't familiar with long suffering long suffering is having or showing patience in spite of your troubles especially if someone causes those troubles to you uh you see with the people out in the riots you see you know the coronavirus got everybody acting wild and getting everybody in their emotions and the feelings then you have politics you know there's so much that i could say but right now in the real world what's going on uh the fruit of the spirit is what everybody needs to you know get uh especially temperance because having restraint over your emotions and your actions can definitely play a role in you know how to move and how to hear god so i did i did want to say that I did want to. I do want to get that out there for you guys. So, before we get into the, the analysis, I just want to say thank you guys. Go ahead if you're new to this channel and you like what you see and hear and feel compelled to sub. Hit the subscribe button. And hit the bell for notifications for future content. I'm just excited for XRP. It looks like we're gonna get our moon soon. But before we get our moon, we have some. Uh, you know, we have some blocks that we need to cover first. So. Stay tuned for the analysis. We're about to jump right in. All right, peace. All right, you guys, we are back. We are now looking at XRP. And XRP is it broke out of the P wave, which I had said it would. And now it did a retest in the red zone here. So now, you now looking at it, what I like to see. For this market to move higher, we need to come back and retest this level here. And we need a break at this level right here. If we don't get a break in this zone, then uh, I, I will very well say XRP price will dwindle if we don't manage to get above 20 cents and 400 right here. But everything looks pretty solid right now. You see what's going on here with the so the Kumo, we're getting a twist right here. Let me go ahead and highlight that. Okay, we're starting to get that twist right there. So that's a good sign for us moving up higher. Uh, what I want to see, like I said, we need to get above here. But this, you know, going off the daily time frame, not enough information. Uh, we have that new distance right here. So we need to see how price is going to react. Looking at it on the four-hour chart, let's go here. It looks like we're about to get a bearish cross right here, but that means we may start ranging in here, like I was saying. So I'm not going to look at this market until we break, you know, this zone or break this zone here or you know, this support. So there's no trade here just yet. Price is just ranging in between this, uh, in between here. So until we get that clean break to the upside, mainly at this level but once we break this zone here i expect prices to start you know skyrocketing up to the 24 to 30 cent range but that's yet to be seen looking at it on the one hour chart 
what I see here. Price is, you know, moving inside the clouds. So there's turbulence going on. We have that bounce here. And we had another in wave form at this price, uh, at this on the chart. We had this first in wave. And then from this area to up, down here. So we may get that pulse back to the upside, depending on how price fares here. Looking like it's moving up strong right now. Uh, let's see. Uh, we got this bearish cloud. So we need this to move up. And we need to start seeing this. The price is to go higher. Uh, another thing that I like here, we held this support. So the Kumo support right here at this level. So we held that and price is not going up. We need to get above this level because like I said, we like we do need to give this above this level first and foremost, the end wave. But if we don't, what will happen is we could fluctuate here, make an end pattern, come back down. But I don't think that's going to be the case. Can it happen? Yes. Uh, right now, there is no opportunity to trade this. Uh, if you are a day trader of XRP at all, there's no opportunity unless you're scalping on a smaller time frame. But even still then, there's still no opportunity. And there's no trend, real trend just yet until we get above this level. Until we get above this level or break below this level here. These are where I'm eyeing at right now. Uh, I believe we will get back into this range here. So for now, let me go ahead and put my target. So right here, this is how I'm targeting this market. It's not a big percentage, but it's something. Um, but yeah, that's my analysis for this. This is not really complicated looking at this. This, this move here, it's, there's nothing really to say here until we get above here and until we get above this level. But until then, I'm still bullish on XRP. Don't get me wrong. I'm just waiting for the big move. This is not it yet. So, you know, you guys stay tuned. If you want daily XRP uh, content, hit the subscribe, um, well, comment in the comment section if you want me to do it. But I'm really thinking about, you know, putting out daily XRP updates for you guys and we'll take over for the XRP analysis since... <laughs> I'm just joking, but... Uh, just being real with you guys, I, I appreciate you guys for you know this coming to this channel and watching my analysis. It's a blessing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment, subscribe, let me know what you're thinking about XRP price, and stay tuned for the next analysis. All right, God bless and be encouraged in Jesus' name. Peace.